Welcome back, folks, to more Diablo 1. The OG. We're in a predicament here of a bunch of these asshole spitting dogs. Maybe keep things moving here. Trying not to get dissolved in their pools of acid. And picking up the loops. Good at killing them. Just got to get close enough before they dissolve me. Poochie Poochie. Remember to save. Can't even fucking see him. Alright, save's pretty instant. Not used to being able to save in these type of games. Like, on the ball like that, usually it starts you back in town, respawn enemy, shit like that. But. Please just give us melee guys. Make it all death wings. Oh shit. Thing to the point where you really need to have elemental resistances, and if you don't, you're indeed due to. It's kind of where they get you. Anyways, welcome to level up. Let's see if we can get, get through this. We, I have a feeling we're gonna need to restart again, and hope we pick up some better shit.
Come on, Ring of the Zodiac. That's what we need. Ring of the Zodiac's a bomb ring that gives you shit tons of resistance to all the elements. You can manage to get a couple of those, you're, you're fucking sick. Holy shit, fuck. We must have some lightning resistance. Probably a good thing. Well, we got ten. Which is better than that. But we'd be better off with like eighty. yourself in an advantageous position, folks. Do not just try to go toe-to-toe -to -toe with these creatures at this level. You will fucking perish. You will perish like you've never perished before. You will be the greatest of perish perishers. You will perish Donald Trump style. You will be the greatest perisher ever. Lug Lug the Demon Slayer, baby. lava here or we're just gonna get thunder fucked by these people. Here we go. Oh, and then we got a big ass fence of them behind us. That's great. Defense up! Oh, 
aren't the fastest weapons you can get, man. We could use the grandfather sword right now. The only way we're gonna win is if we start finding some better shit. Too bad as long as you're not getting hit by a shitload of them at range. Yep, walk the fuck out of there. Oops. Resist all 30. Yes, please. Armor class is 10, but resist all 30. The Jade Crown. That puts us at 40% resistance. Due to... this ring of truth granted we don't have lifesteal but this resist at this point is uh, huge so that's a very good spell for us to or a very good item for us to have for now we'll identify and sell the rest repair our new crown hello my friend Stay a while and listen. Bow of the Giants. Dagger of the Moon. So I can't even use that because I don't have 80 decks. I'm not going to have 80 decks anytime soon, so we'll sell that. Well, what can I do for you? I guess this is good for this current level that I'm on. I can go to resist lightning 20. The amulet of Might just gives me plus 9 strength. Probably don't need strength that much to be honest.
Well, I don't know. I am a fighter. This is probably more helpful for this particular level, though, because it's going to give me 60% resistance. We'll try it out. We can always put our amulet back on. When we're not fighting what lightning monsters, it's definitely better to have our might. love there. Greetings, good master. Welcome to the tavern. I am afraid that I don't know anything about that, good master. Cain has many books that may be of some help. <sighs> the Chamber of Bones. Hello, my friend. Stay a while. A book that speaks of a chamber of human bones? Well, a chamber of bone is mentioned in certain archaic writings that I studied in the libraries of the East. These tomes inferred that when the lords of the underworld desired to protect great treasures, they would create domains where those who died in the attempt to steal that treasure would be forever bound to defend it. A twisted, but strangely fitting, end. Gonna pick up some gold and go see if work. The squirt has anything new. Good day. How? I am afraid that I haven't heard anything about that. Perhaps. All right. Everyone says talk to Kane about that. I was just trying to get new dialogue. You can talk to each of the characters about all the different questicles. Work better have some new shit. Probably also just drop a drop a load of gold by work. Squirt the squirt. Psst, over here. Blade of Ages. It's indestructible. That's it. Pretty fucking lame. Sometimes he'll have great shit. Sometimes not so much. Yeah, it's always good to have some plus magic things like this as well, because it'll help you read books, and then you can, of course, take it off. Well, what can I do for you? of the eagle. Twenty-four armor, faster hit recovery. Fast hit recovery is important. Wow, well, what can I do for you? Oh, 
what can I do for you? What are we at? 56 mana? <laughs> that ain't shit. Alright, let's see. 60, 60 lightning will uh, definitely help us out here. Shit. Strength, strength, and more strength. We need to hit hard. We have Dex maxed out. Probably use more vitality. Of course, everything's fucking dead now that I get some massive electrical resistance. some life there. in the ass they don't have more gaps between this lava river here. I think we're done here though. It's time to head into... Oh shit. Yeah, I guess we can uh, go down a little further. Remember only 16 levels in this game so... It's gonna start getting hot. All right, suck you by. They're gonna be straight up resist magic. They hurt. We didn't have that 40%. We need to get smoked. They 
They like to run like goats. Sucky by Addis, we're fucked. <laughs> Get a lot of XP to hit 21. That's the next level up of the Poochies. That doesn't give us a quest, apparently. T 
take heed and bear witness to the truths that lie herein, for they are the last legacy of the Haradrim. Nearly 300 years ago, it came to be known that the three prime evils of the burning hells had mysteriously come to our world. The three brothers ravaged the lands of the East for decades, stay alive here. while humanity was left trembling in their wake. Our that's fucking annoying as fuck, dude. Can't even pause the goddamn game while you read. Oh, that's so stupid. Very efficient either. enough mana. Yeah, that's a problem. Can shoot you off the screen as well. Yeah, with no shield, you're fucked.
Not enough mana. Be able to get out of here alive. Someone drop a fucking mana potion already. I'm out, bitch. Yeah, we're in a predicament with that level. It's not gonna be easy. Hello, my friend. Stay a while and listen. Seventeen strength, but only forty-eight damage. This is two to ten, but. Plus 9 to hit and 44% damage. Plus 10 to strength. Still think it's better than both these. Not getting lightning anymore, so we might as well take off our lightning amulet. Doesn't doesn't really help. What can I do for you? Oh, the stars which I cannot use. What ails you, my friend? I sense a soul in search of answers. The heart and the mind can perform miracles when they are in perfect harmony. The healer Pepin sees into the body in a way that even I cannot. 
His ability to restore the sick and injured is magnified by his understanding of the creation of elixirs and potions. He is as great an ally as you have in Tristram. Serve you. Well, we can go check with Word again. Some mail. That seems pretty good. That's 145% armor. Doesn't that bring it up to like. Fuck. 75,000? Should we buy it? I think we should. 24 armor. Over here. This is 32 armor plus 145% armor. I don't know if I have enough though. 75,000, right? That's expensive as fuck. Yeah, I don't think we have enough. Which sucks, because that's really good fucking armor, and it's going to be gone. Now we might be close. Seventy-one thousand. Oh, what can I do for you? Wow, what can I do for you? Hope this is worth it. <laughs> I spent a lot of money on it. Doesn't really do jack shit against uh, resistances, but neither did our other stuff. Psst, over here. Yeah, that puts us up in the next uh, armor range there. Well, it gives us the male armor look anyways. It's a little bit different than plate, but... Armor class is 111. I didn't even bother to look what the other one was.
Too late now! So that's going to help a lot against physical attacks. Ain't going to really do shit against all this uh, elemental stuff, though. We've got to keep that in mind. So we're still going to have to dip, dodge, duck, and fucking dodge. <laughs> These big guys have a hard time hitting us, though. Father Sword. So it will be great. It's like a scroll of town portal any day. Sucks because we don't have a good enough bow to, to attack these guys. So we're gonna have to corner each one. And they're just gonna run around like a bunch of little fucking bitch asses. leader. Which fire the unholy. She might drop something good. She might not drop shit. Go ahead and get your little... Drop the fucking shitty ass dagger. Thank <laughs> you. 
All right, well, we did manage to clear level 12. Well, we still got a little bit up there. That'll probably be it for this video. I don't know if we're going to be able to, to muster up level 13. If it was all melee shit, sure. But it's as if they know I'm a fighter and I suck at ranged. speed. Very hard to hit for melee now. It's nice and quiet. Maybe now I can read a book. Take heed and bear witness to the truths that lie herein, for they are the last legacy of the Haradrim. Nearly 300 years ago, it came to be known that the three prime evils of the Burning Hells had mysteriously come to our world. The three brothers ravaged the lands of the East for decades, while humanity was left trembling in their wake. Our order, the Haradrim, was founded by a group of secretive magi to hunt down and capture the three evils once and for all. The original Haradrim captured two of the three within powerful artifacts known as soul stones and buried them deep beneath the desolate eastern sands. The third evil escaped capture and fled to the west with many of the Haradrim in pursuit. The third evil, known as Diablo, the Lord of Terror, was eventually captured, his essence set in a soul stone and buried within this labyrinth. Be warned that the soul stone must be kept from discovery by those not of the faith. If Diablo were to be released, he would seek a body that is easily controlled, as he would be very weak, perhaps that of an old man or a child. Let's take a gander at level 13 and see if it's feasible. We are very close to level 21. I think 100 strength is the max for the fighter. We need to get there. Oh shit. I must be getting close. Yep, these are the hell levels. But 
that in no way means that we're ready to take them on. Gonna start finding wizards and shit. Ah! Alright, we like those. Alright, here comes the big demons. These are also better for us to fight. Not too many at once, though. Get surrounded, we are fucked. Now, like I said, if we get surrounded, we are fucked. can do this if we can get them in a the doorway. <laughs> this is where we're going to find all the best treasure. So if we have to restart, we kind of just want to haul ass down, back down here at this point. Well, we pissed off a whole bunch of them. Okay, as you can see, you can't do shit if you get too many at once. The hit recovery fucks you up. is not going to happen. strength we need to do more damage we need way better weaponry here Nearly strong enough to fight Diablo. You want to be level 25, 26. Considering we're on level 13, highly unlikely we'll be able to do it on this run. Trying to get these guys divided up here. video let's head back see what we got get some more potions and we'll see how deep in 13 we can get hello my friend stay a while and listen dagger of vampires useless for us 
30 to magic. Great for great for a sorcerer, wizard, whatever. Not so great for us. Wow, what can I do for you? However, the nice thing about the plus 30 to magic is we can hang on to that amulet. That'll help us read books and get our mana up as well. Gold Amulet of Brilliance. Puts our to hit up to 115. That might be uh, better than the, the plus 9 strength. To hit is uh, obviously very important. You can't hit, you ain't doing shit. Wow, what can I do for you? Gone, but we got this beautiful, awesome mail. What ails you, my friend? All right, folks, that's gonna wrap it up. We'll see you soon with more Diablo.